today we're talking with Bob Feldman, the co-founder co of Freemius. So, can you introduce yourself quickly? Sure. Uh, so, I'm Bob, again, uh, from Israel right now. Uh, I'm coming from Freemius. Uh, Freemius is an e-commerce engine as a service. We help plugin and theme developers to turn their code into commercial solutions in a matter of minutes. And since we're also coming as a partner, we're really involved in their business and trying to proactively help them to get better. Because we make money and they make money. So a lot of businesses uh, sell their products on their own website. So what are the benefits of you know doing it on premiums? Sure. Uh, so first of all, there are a bunch of solutions in the market. Freemius is a service uh, compared to other solutions where you actually need to install plugins on your website, maintain them, etc. When you're using a service, there is a benefit because you don't need to uh, handle all this maintenance. Mm -hmm. If there are issues, API changes in PayPal, Stripe, whatever, uh, we uh, know about that and we just deploy fixes and we make sure you know that the subscription money is going in whether you are working right now or in a vacation with your family. Uh, we are there, and also as a, uh, as a service, we act as a reseller, which means that we handle the EU VAT. Uh, so if you uh, want to sell to European customers, we remove this hassle from your end. So we know that you're a fan of the free and the premium model. Right. What's, why is that? Why do you think that's good? Sure, so we are in an open source community, uh, and I do see uh, a huge benefit in uh, having a free version for, because not everyone can afford to buy your product. But on the other hand, it gives you a lot of value because you can learn about your users, uh, get feedback from much more users than you could get if you're only a premium only product. Uh, and I think it's kind of a fair game because the people that have the money can buy the paid version that really need the extra features. They're helping to sponsor the project and the company so everyone in the community can benefit the free users and also the paid ones. And what about the model of subscription and a one-time payment? Would you like to talk about that? What do you prefer? Yeah, sure. So uh, it depends on the product. There are different mm -hmm. types of products. Uh, products that are kind of for a one-time thing, let's say an export plugin or an import plugin for those products it makes more sense to send them uh, in a lifetime license because usually they're used like for a one time thing mm -hmm. and that's it. But for products that are ongoing and you keep using them, uh, there's a higher chance for uh, support tickets over time and not necessarily in the beginning. And it's a much more sustainable model, the subscriptions, and I think it's becoming uh, de facto the standard right now in WordPress and we help to get there. Because if you look five years ago, it was kind of strange to do subscription. Mm -hmm. Many people didn't do that. And if they did, it was manual renewals and not something that automatically renewed. Mm -hmm. But if you think about it, most people who actually pay for products, they're, they're business owners. They're making some sort of money. And they prefer to have this peace of mind that they know they have support when they need it. And they don't need to think about, okay, after a year, now I need to go find this license, go to some website, upgrade again, it's a hassle. So the automatic renewals actually simplifies their life because they don't need to think about this stuff. So I'm a big believer in subscriptions and the whole subscription economy. Uh, and I think it's good that the WordPress bubble economy kind of um, adopting that model because it's already adopted all over outside of WordPress. So Going back to, to Freemius, is there anything else you want our viewers to, to know about it? Um, I would mention our blog, mm -hmm. uh, freemius.com slash blog. Uh, so we invest a lot of resources in really good content covering many topics related to the business side of the WordPress mm -hmm. plugins and business economy. Uh, so whether you're just starting or you're in advanced stage but want to learn about specific things like you mentioned subscriptions whether i should do monthly subscriptions or only annual or how to price the lifetime correctly so we cover all these different topics pricing marketing uh, partnerships affiliation everything uh, and this is what we do so check it out cool cool we all certainly will and so the last question 
as you know, as you can see, the logo of WP Crib is a duck. So, what do you think is the sound that a duck makes? Uh, I don't know exactly, but I know Donald Duck and it sounds like that. <laughs> Something like that. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's impressive, actually. So, thank you so much. That's been Volvo from Freemius, and uh, see you another time. Pleasure to talk to you.